Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on November 13th, 2024. Welcome to another Surviving Day on the Planet, and welcome to a quick update here. As I wanted to share the forecast models here, as we do have a tropical system developing for parts of Guatemala in the long range forecast here, and then into Merida, and then eventually into Florida. So late season hurricane here will and is forecast for Tampa Bay, Florida by the 20th of November. Watching the forecast models here, it's going to stall just north of Porto Lempira, south of Georgetown, and then smash into Merida Monday night into Tuesday night, and then make landfall Wednesday, Tampa Bay, Florida. Looks like the eye so far, the forecast, the cone of uncertainty will be from Cape Corral north to Tampa Bay. And then watch as this thing scoots into the Atlantic Ocean and major systems, huge low pressure systems are developing in the northern hemisphere right now. And this is why I'm making the video. Possible super storms developing in the northern hemisphere right now. And look at these forecast models over the next couple of days. It's going to quickly turn into a tropical depression and then a hurricane by Sunday into Monday. And then it most likely will sustain hurricane status, making landfall Tampa Bay Wednesday the 20th. Those were the wave height models. We could see upwards of nine meters of uh, nine meter height waves with that tropical system making landfall Florida. Having a look at the Northern Hemisphere, you can see a massive system, huge low pressure system, scooting southward, just north of Iceland there. This will be affecting Europe in the long range forecast, lots of moisture and some extreme cold temperatures. But look at the size of this low pressure system. I've never seen anything like it. And I've been saying that a lot recently, and I've never reported so many erupting volcanoes. I've never seen so many huge forecasted low pressure systems. Look at the size of this beast for the long range forecast for Europe. Europe superstorm developing forecast here towards the end of November. And as I said, there's lots of cold temperatures coming down with these low pressure systems from the North Pole right now. Polar vortex is setting up. If you haven't seen that, please check out last night's video as I did show our upper level winds. But it's going to be a very windy and wild week or weeks ahead. Right up until the end of November for all of Europe. So potential superstorm warning for Europe. And as I said, cold temperatures are coming here. Having a look at temperature forecasts here. Watch for the blues and the whites to start creeping in right around the same time as that low pressure system comes from the north. Parts of Central Europe will be in the minus double digits. Higher elevations, of course. Across North America, quite the battle between the equatorial warmth and the northern polar vortex. Watch for extreme weather to keep breaking out here. This is a live look at Invest Area 99L. Huge low pressure system in the North Atlantic. Huge one in the Pacific as well. And then we've got Tropical Storm Manyi. And we've got Typhoon Usagi Ophel affecting northern Philippines and then into Taipei, Taiwan. And then we've got Typhoon Nika. So five tropical systems in the Pacific and one now in the Atlantic. Much love, everybody. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Please like, share, subscribe. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun and get your daily dues.